Hey guys, welcome to another one of my videos. Today I'm going to introduce to you two new designs of Tamagotchi pouch. One is in the pattern of the earth and one is in the pattern of our beloved favorite character Kuchipachi. If you recall previously, we used to sell this previous design as well. This is the Huggy Bear Tamagotchi pouch and it was really successful and almost sold out. These pouches are compatible with almost any color Tamagotchi. Let me just show you the features before we test it out. As you can see, the features are actually like embroidered on. And if I unzip it, it comes with an internal foam to keep the Tamagotchi in place. This is how the inside looks like. It comes with gold finishings, as you can see on the zipper and the other metal fixtures. And each of the pouch also comes with its own matching acrylic keychain. And the artwork on the acrylic keychains are hand-drawn by us. It also comes with a little hole at the back. This is for the Tamagotchi Pix camera. Similar for the Kuchipachi pouch. You can see like the features are embroidered. We have a matching Kuchipachi burger keychain. And again, there's like a little hole for the Tamagotchi Pix camera. I just want to address some of the defects that you're going to see in this video because this is a sample, but rest assured that they will not appear in the actual final product. So firstly, it's the wording. As you can see, the wording here isn't really pretty to look at as compared to this one, the actual product will look like this. You can see that the outline is clearly drawn with a marker pen. So rest assured that in the actual product, it's going to be printed on. Same goes for like the outline of the lips. Next, we're going to see how each Tamagotchi fits in the pouch. Now first, we're going to use it with the pigs. So for the pigs, it actually has a camera at the back. So that's what the camera hole on the back of the pouch is for. First, we have this piece of foam here and the foam is going to hold the Tamagotchi in place. So you fit the foam into the pouch and then you fit your pigs into the foam. And then we zip it up. And there we go. Now, because the pigs has touch buttons, you want to still be able to access the buttons while it's in the pouch. So that's why we actually made the pouch um, accessible through the front. There's a window, right? So you can access the touch buttons even while it's in the pouch. There's also a hole in the back for the Tamagotchi Pix camera. And you can press the top where the shutter button is to take a picture even while in the pouch. Next, we're going to use it with the piece. Now for the piece, we're going to have to first remove the pierce because it won't fit. Okay, and then it looks like that. Now, I'm going to remove the picks. And then we put the piece in it. And because the piece has like physical buttons, we don't need to actually um, access the buttons through the window here. So we're going to have this transparent plastic that comes with the pouch. We're going to insert this on top here like this. So it provides extra protection to avoid scratches on the screen. And you're still able to play with your Tamagotchi while it's in the pouch. Now we're going to try on the Tamagotchi on or mids. So this time, let's use the Kuchipachi pouch instead. And then fit your Tamagotchi on inside. Again, we're not going to need to access any touch screen or touch buttons. So we're going to use this transparent plastic on the top here to protect our Tamagotchi from scratches. And it looks like this. I also have an IDL here. So this is just to show you how it looks like on an IDL. This is how it looks like on a For You or For You Plus. Finally, we're going to use it on the Tamagotchi Uni and Smart. Now, the Tamagotchi Uni and Smart are similar in size and shape. The only difference is that the Smart has a touch screen while the Uni doesn't. If you are using it with the Tamagotchi Smart, then obviously you need to access the touch screen. So you're not going to have to use the transparent plastic piece that comes with the pouch. For the Uni and Smart, we're going to use another type of foam, which looks like this. So you're going to first put the foam in. And because this model is thinner than the others, we're going to have to also add on this little piece of foam here, like so. And then you put your Tamagotchi in and close it up. And as you can see, you can access the touch screen and you can still access the button. Next, we're going to use it on the Uni. Because the Tamagotchi Uni does not have a touch screen or touch button, 
we can use this transparent plastic to put it over to protect it from the top. So first, I'm going to put this transparent piece of plastic here. And then, again, use the same type of foam. Again, this little piece here. There are some customers who said that even with the piece of foam, when you are playing with the Tamagotchi, like pushing all the buttons, the foam actually goes down and it becomes too deep. So if you feel that the Tamagotchi becomes too deep, you can actually add like some thickness back here. Like you can see I've just glued a little bit of paper here. So it's really up to you. It's really optional. It depends on your play style, right? So if you think that you want some more thickness, just add a little bit more yourself and then put it in like this and fit the Tamagotchi in. And this is how it looks like on the Uni and Smart. And as you can see, you can still access the button. So it's really convenient to play with. These pouches are not officially for sale yet. We are actually having a Kickstarter campaign right now. So if you are interested to get your hands on one of these, do support us so that we can have enough funds to bring this product to reality. Thank you so much for watching, guys. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye!